You know when you don't think you need it until you see it? This. This is... Finally, someone has made it. Now, I found this on Instagram by a guy called Game Boy Shack, I think. Uh, I missed his first one, and a few days later, he released, like, a new bundle. Uh, and it's basically random uh, Game Boys. Custom Game Boys. It could be an SP. It could be an Advance. It could be a DMG. And then he had a bigger one, like the large mystery box. Now, this one's 75 pounds, so it's expensive. You're looking at 90 bucks in the US, but he does do ones for 50 pounds um, in the UK, which is around about 60 bucks, which I don't know. I don't know what to expect. This is my first one from him. I'm gonna open it up and I'm gonna see what I've got in this 75 pound Game Boy mystery box. Now, I'm excited. I'm so excited, I haven't even bragged my knife. I got it, just the little one. Now, as mentioned, no idea what to expect. It could be a complete flop, but it could be something pretty, pretty good. Like I saw the picture where he was like, you can get any of this. And there, there was some beauties in there. I actually tweeted it and a few of you got back to me with your favorites. Um, so hopefully I'm gonna be in with some luck and I'm gonna get some good or it would make for a funny video if I get something absolutely terrible. So let's dive in. Let's see what I got. I'm excited. I have no idea what to expect. So this is the Game Boy Mystery Box by a guy on Instagram that I did no background check on whatsoever. It could just be a box of bricks. It is heavy. Like this thing's heavy. All right, I'll do it like this so you can see. Let's open it up and see what we've got. Oh, he's put them in different packages. That's what I like. Teasing me even more. We've got, what the hell? All right, we've got, <laughs> we've got one package here. The second package here, we've got a Pam, a Pac-Man Frisbee here. All right, I'll take it. Jesus Christ, there's a lot of stuff in here. He is, he has gone crazy. So, so we've got a Super Mario heat changing mug. We've got, what is this? Some M&Ms, thanks dude. Uh, we've got some Tetris stickers here. Oh my God, we'll get into all this. We've got more chocolates. We've got a Charizard here. We've got some Jelly Babies. We've got some M&Ms. we got a, oh my God, is that the 90s? That's the 2000 Nintendo uh, Pokemon little rollerblade things. They're actually collectibles. We've got Reese's Peanut Butter Tree. We've got a lanyard, which seems to be like Kirby. We've got some Toblerones. We've got stickers. We've got a Game Boy cartridge here with two, whoa, two 3DS games in here. What the bloody hell? So we got Ridge Racer 3D and Lego Ninjago. All right, dude. All right, and we've got Ash Ketchum there, a little figurine. What is this? We've got something here. I have no idea what that is. And something here. Let's... Jesus Christ, this is a large box. Now, this guy needs to make this Game Boy box official before I do. He needs to start getting a business behind it. He start, needs to get custom boxes. These stickers are actually really cool as well. So I've got three stickers here. If you tweet me with something, say a nice video, I'll pick two of you and I'll send out two of these stickers here. So all you gotta do is tweet me and say nice video or something. All right, so let's get the little stuff out the way. We've got the Kirby, uh, lanyard here we've got dark chocolate mint m ms i don't think i've ever tried some of these what they look weird i hope they're in date oh my god oh my god we do not have these in the uk mm! that's some good stuff that's some good stuff all right i'm excited Maynard Bassett's, very British sweets, good stuff. Toblerone, again, Swedish. Reese's Pieces, that kind of stuff, that's starting to come into the UK a bit more now. We've got Tetris sticker set, which look like 3D stuff, so you can add to your uh, books and that, pretty cool. We've got a uh, Mega Evolution Charizard plush here. You know what, I'll give that away as well. Tweet me if you want that. I'll pick up random. We've got Santa Claus Smarties with reindeers, M&Ms, 
Ash Ketchum, two 3DS games, Toblerone, Namco Frisbee, and a cool little Gengar collectible. Now I know what you want to see. What's in this stuff? What is in this stuff? Let's have a look. Oh boy, this is some good stuff. I'm liking this. This is like, what? I don't know. Like I was th originally thinking of Pokeball because it's round, but doesn't seem, oh, what the? Looks like a mini Game Boy. Oh, oh, dude, that's cool. Because it is Christmas. He's added in what looks like to be a little Game Boy key ring into a Christmas ball. That is actually really cool, dude. That is going on my tree. ASAP. Good thinking, dude. I like that, man. Touche. All right, now this has got a bit of weight to it. So this, to me, looks like a Mega Man energy drink. I don't think I've ever seen one of these before. He's double layered it. My man, he knows. He knows what to do. So what we have here is a Mega Man E-Tank energy drink, I'm guessing? From Boston America Corporation. I haven't seen one of these, so either he's getting them sent in from abroad, then wrapping them up, or he's finding a supplier somewhere, so that's cool. Let's, let's try out this. This will probably blow up now. Nope, all right. Jesus Christ, that's blue. You can't see that, but it's really, really blue. Yep, blueberry for sure. Refreshing. I like it. And then finally, of the smaller gifts, we have a Super Mario mug, which changes when it's heated up. Heated up? Heated up? So obviously, the black will go blue today when it's heated up. My kettle's broke, so I won't be using that anytime soon. Right. Let's get into the uh, two packages and hopefully two Game Boys. Let's get this big one here. So let's see what we've got. Okay, okay, okay. What? All right. Oh, no. I don't think he's gave me a Game Boy. <laughs> oh, no. That went downhill really fucking quick. Okay, so this look, this is a Nintendo DS stand with a uh, UK adapter. Oh no. Oh no. I was dreading this would happen. Out there was like, there must have been like 15 Game Boys and one DS. And I think he's just gave me a DS. Oh man, I don't even want, <laughs> oh no. All right, that was depressing. So it looks like, okay, so this is a 3DS here. Uh, you definitely use condition. There's a few scratches, uh, but it, it's okay, I guess. Okay condition. Like, you know me. <laughs> so there it, there it is. Like, it's in okay condition, actually. Um, does it come with a pen? Yep, the pen's there. It's charged. The buttons work. Um, okay, so there you have it. The Game Boy subscription box came with, it's not even a subscription box, it's a mystery box, came with a Nintendo 3DS. Not a Game Boy, I'm not gonna lie, but it came with a 3DS here. Uh, mm, that was a bit depressing, wasn't it? I was so hoping for a DMG. But, uh, <laughs> wow, what a way to round off the video. All right, so, like, it's a, it's, a, it's a working, functioning 3DS here. Okay condition. All the ports, the buttons work. So, you know, you could definitely find one of these cheaper than 75 pounds, without a doubt, and then he's just chucked in a load of stuff with it. I just took a picture of something then, somehow. All right, so, like, and then that goes on there if you want to play or charge. So I'm guessing that's like your little charging dock, right? Can you tell I've never had a 3DS? I only had a 2DS. Uh, so there you have it. 
the Game Boy Mystery Box had a Nintendo 3DS. Yeah, I probably won't be buying one of them again, but there is a link below if any of you want to check it out. Like, you'll probably have better luck than me. It's just typical me, always getting uh, bad luck, but you never know. Like, someone who actually ordered the Game Boy uh, Mystery Box might actually really enjoy that. So there you have it, a quick unboxing of the Game Boy Mystery Box that I found on Instagram. Let me know if you want me to order like other mystery boxes that I find online, like weird ones, like retro ones. Um, I've done that in a past with a Pokemon one, never uploaded it. I paid £100 for a mystery box and it came with like 50 plushes. That was it. But they advertised it as like Pokemon Red, Retro, Game Boys. And I got scammed. And like I didn't get scammed here, but I was hoping for a Game Boy. But instead got free, yes. So there you have it, I just took another selfie. Okay, it really wants to take selfies. So there you have it, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video. My favorite thing was actually the Game Boy Advance Bulbul. That was depressing.